I hear a dragon. It does not see me. Can fast travel. Good. Oh no. I have your sweet role. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Go away. Let's see here. Ah, there's a new lady in charge of the orphanage in Riften. She asked me to hand out these notices to everyone I met. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Oh. It again. This little... Oh, missed one. There we go. All right. Time to meet the family. Silence, my brother. Ah, at last. I hope you found the place all right. So what happens now? Well, what happens now is you start your new life in the Dark Brotherhood. You're part of the family, after all. This, as you can see, is our sanctuary. You won't find a safer place in all of Skyrim. So get comfortable. I'm honored to be part of the family, Astrid. Our family, my dearest. Our family. Together, united as one. The Dark Brotherhood can accomplish anything, but you must be anxious to get to work. I'm arranging a job, but need a bit more time. For now, go see Nazir. He's got several smaller contracts. Soon, the Night Mother will arrive, and things around here are sure to get even more interesting. Ah, oh, but one last thing. A welcome home present. The Armor of the Dark Brotherhood. May it serve you well in all your endeavors. Are there any rules I need to be aware of? Used to be the Dark Brotherhood was bound by five tenets, but we stopped following those years ago. All those rules, all that discipline, and look where the Dark Brotherhood ended up. We're the last of our kind. And we live the way we see fit. Bottom line, respect your family. Do that, and everything else will fall into place. Be sure and introduce yourself to your new family members. They're all very... need you. Shrouded mail. It's light armor. Okay. So that tells me the mod I installed for heavy armor, Dark Brotherhood, did not install. Oh, rather, it installed. 
It just wasn't what I thought it was. So you're the newest member of our dwindling, dysfunctional little family. I've heard quite a bit about you. But really, a worker, some twine, three wood elves, and a hatchet? Ah, going for the mysterious and brooding thing, huh? That may work for your targets, but you'll find I'm not so easily impressed. Did she now? Well, as it turns out, there are a few lingering contracts we haven't had the chance to complete just yet. And more, dribbling in from time to time. I'll assign them to you as they become available, to be completed at your leisure. It is. These aren't particularly glamorous assassinations, I'll be honest. Don't pay much either. But they'll keep you busy. Just do them as you're able. There's no real time limit. The targets aren't going anywhere. You can turn each one in as it's completed, or wait and turn in the whole group when all the targets have been eliminated. Whichever works for you. Ready for the first set. Well then, let's get started. I've got three available right now. Your targets are the beggar Narfi, an ex-miller named Enodius Papias, and Baytilde. A mind boss. When you've completed all those, we'll see if I might have some more. Okay. Welcome, my brother. Welcome to our sanctuary. You have made the right choice joining us, I assure you. You just trust in Astrid, follow her orders, and you'll do fine here. Once I was a Shadow Scale, an assassin in service to the King of Black Marsh, trained by the Dark Brotherhood since the day of my hatching. Ah, but that was a lifetime ago. Today, I am the last of my kind. My order is extinct. Now, I happily serve Astrid in this sanctuary. I am a trained killer, and once again have been given purpose. Life is good. Stay safe. So, apothecary. Ooh. It's time for the barbarian to begin multi classing. Don't let my appearance throw you off. I'm older than you, a lot older. Getting bitten by a vampire when you're ten will do that to a girl. <laughs> I like Babette. It's as rewarding as it is dangerous. Let's see what I can show you. Show me all the things. Huh? Have a contract. Sky tweak. Vendors. I don't know why that was reset to five. It's been quite. It's as rewarding as it is dangerous. Let's see what I can show you. A.
Okay, illusion. There's alchemy. No, go back to alchemy. Poisons you mix are 1% more power. Per level? I'll take it. One additional hit per 10 levels of alchemy? Yes. Allowing you to ignore 40% armor rating of affected target for their duration. Bet. All effects revealed. Upgrade a lab to an advanced version for 2500 gold. Advanced lab potions are 25% stronger. Sweet. Festus. Yes, yes, you're the new family member. Let's make this easy. Consider me the cranky old uncle nobody talks to. You go your way, I'll go mine. Nice to meet you, Festus. <laughs> but I was. When I was 13, I accidentally burned down the family home. I went on to teach at the college. Left after two years. Too simple. Too safe. None of them truly understood the glory of the destruction school. My targets school. make the mistake of not perceiving me as a threat. New Last brother, may I offer my most sincere welcome to our family. It's nice to meet you, Gabriella. You certainly have a strange energy about you. I look forward to following your progress. What a curious question. Well, I enjoy the midnights, taking long walks on the beach, knitting, and unicorns. In fact, I once took a seaside stroll on a moonlit night and discovered a unicorn, which I proceeded to stab in the throat with a crochet needle. I'm a woman Tell of refined me, yet Are simple tastes. Clear? I like you. you I like Gabriella a lot. What a curious question. <laughs> well, I enjoy uh, moonlit nights, say? taking long walks on the beach, like knitting, and unicorns. Kill Why, well, so and often. You slew everyone. Okay. Except that one. I kept a lot of sir. Does your wickedness or your skill know no bounds? What? You think me too old, too feeble? There is more knowledge in me than in two of you pups put together. And knowledge. Knowledge is my. I like Festus. Festus is my favorite. Spooter. You're not going to attack me, are you? No. Gaston Bellafort. Hastily scribbled note. My scribing tools are lost and have no time for a lengthy entry anyway. It's taken weeks, but I finally found it. The Sanctuary of the Dark Brotherhood. One of them, anyway, in Skyrim under a forest road. I've been watching them, the assassins, their comings and goings. The fools have no idea they're being observed. My next goal is to somehow make it past the sinister black door into the Sanctuary itself. I don't have time to even think about the dangers. The truth must be known. You got fed to a spider. I think you should have thought about the danger. Sure. The temple contract? Well, I certainly won't deny of it. <laughs> As a suicide mission, Astrid said as much. I can only read the second one. Never betray the Dark Brotherhood or its secrets. To do so is to invoke the wrath of Sithis. Huh. Is 
some white cap. Let me guess. Astrid failed to mention I'm her husband. She has a tendency to do that. Doesn't want the others thinking she plays favorites. Look, if you're trying to get to know me, don't. I don't like you, and I never will. It's nothing personal, but my wife trusts you, and I trust her judgment. So you can't be all bad. Here's all you need to know. I'm a werewolf. I like killing things. I love Astrid. I hate annoying people. And the color blue gives me a headache. Eh? The color blue gives you a headache. Well, often. I don't have any of my materials here. That's fine. I'm afraid I don't have a primary contract for you yet. Oh, fun fact. You can actually TCL through this wall and find the Blade of Woe. Right here. Astrid obviously isn't laying here because she's over there, but... Yeah. Ah! Narfi, Enodius Papatus, or Papius, and Baytild. 